Masibulele Machaya never finished high school. He roamed the streets unqualified. But in 2013, he started repairing shoes. Soon, he started making them. Now, his shoes are in demand around these parts. Being unemployed, life becomes difficult because there are things that you need to, to survive and more, most of the things are financial well-being. So financially, it wasn't like lucrative to be unemployed and some things you can't do in terms of your, your house uh, and, and having income for, for business. Just keeping the local rights clean is an invaluable lifeline for this group of youngsters. It doesn't pay much, but it keeps the pot cooking. It's not nice not having any money at all. You sit at home and do nothing and spend most of your days roaming the streets and getting up to no good. And it is not enough to take care of me and my family. But at least it's better than having nothing at all. Statistics South Africa has paid the official unemployment rate in the Eastern Cape at 42.8% in the second quarter of this year. But young people say the reality on the ground is much worse. The youth unemployment rate is over the 60% mark. Not having a job is so hard, especially when you live in the township. You wake up and do nothing. And this leaves room for you to get up to all kinds of not good things because we have nothing to do. I want a job so bad and I am trying, but I'm just not winning. We are here in the township with qualifications and we are not getting any jobs. It's really not nice at all to have a degree and have no place to work. It's sad to live like this because only those who have connections get jobs. If you don't have a relative in high places, you will die looking for a job. For example, like a construction. The biggest metro in the province, Nels Mandela Bay, recorded an unemployment figure of 34,7% in the measured second quarter, and the Buffalo City Metro, 27,3%. Lerato Fekisi, SABC News, Kabecha.